Hey everyone, let's play some games today. I'm playing a mid-range warrior. I mean, it's pretty much, it comes from the Temple Warrior, but I've changed it a bit. And it seems, you know, more like a traditional mid-range deck. Uh, it doesn't have the same amount of charges and it has a few more mid-range minions like Sylvanas and Bloodhoof. And so far it has been working out quite well. Uh, slightly over 60% win rate so far. So let's see how we can do here. Hopefully keep the win rate up. Maybe gain some ranks. Oh, right. And I added two pirates. The Bloodsail Raiders. I like them quite a bit. I mean, they feel pretty similar to the Amanis. They both have like that potential to get the extra attack, but even without a buff, you still two freeze. Which is pretty nice. Well, let's coin out that because it has. We have the Taskmaster. But even without the Taskmaster, I think I would have done it. I have a pretty good curve overall. Oh, and um, I also I tried to make the deck better against Priest because I'm starting to see a lot of Priests again, which was giving my Hunter <laughs> some trouble. So. That is also why I have removed the Loot Hoarder and added a Battle Rage instead, since the Loot Hoarder just tended to get stolen by that Cabal Shadow Priest and it was like really annoying. And I also added two... Um, are those Stealth ones? The three mana Stealth ones, the two twos that get stronger every turn? For some reason I can't remember what they're called. But yeah, I added them instead of the harvest columns because they don't get stolen. Uh, let's see here. Hmm. Not great. Definitely not. But let's play that and hope that he does not have a silence. Because that would be really annoying. Like silence that killed the... Ah, oh, that's fine. To play the loot holder whirlwind. I think I do. My hand is a bit lackluster here. I could draw some cards to improve the situation. So let's do that. And um Hmm. Do I attack? I think I just end turn here. Okay, if he uses AoE, I will get two more cards. I have lots of cards. He actually does not have that many cards for a hand luck. Mm, I'll have some options next turn. I can play Fiery Warx plus Blood Cell Raider. I can play Sludge Bills or Acid Drake. Let's see what he does. I was a little afraid of some Shadow Flame. That, that's like why I considered attacking there, in case he did Shadow Flame on the Defender. But, okay. Wow, Whirlwind would be so good here. But I don't have that. Let's see. I think I might play the 5v Warx here. Just so I can kill that. And I'll kill that, I think. Let's see what I draw. Okay, loaf it. And then let's play the Blood Sail Raider. Hope he doesn't have Mortal Coil. So where are my executes and the Black Knight? Could really use it because I think he will play something big very soon. Ah, he did have the Mortal Coil. That's pretty unfortunate. But doesn't look too bad. Okay, so I have to shade, have an Amani. He has not used any AoE yet. Hmm. Maybe I should just play the Acid Drake, see and draw something, because I need some executes and stuff. Okay, another shade. Oh. Where are those executes? Because I'm afraid of getting him low without them. 
I don't want to play Sylvana as an empty board because then it can just be killed with like a siphon soul and it doesn't get anything. So many possibilities. Hmm. Maybe a molten giant? Sun fairy protector? Oh, molten mountain giant. Ah, where is that execute? Okay, that's pretty wonderful. Black Knight, very useful. I think I'll just play two shades here. And he might AoE. Hmm. But I'm kind of banking on the fact that he will taunt up his uh, Mountain Giant and then I can Black Knight it. I could also have played Sylvanas there. That would have been fine. In fact, it might even have been better. Hmm. Okay. Well, let's see. Silvers have an execute, but at least I can Black Knight one of those. And. Black Knight. I don't really want to take another 8 damage. So, I'm gonna do that, that, and let's clear the board. He has used both of his Mountain Giants, he lost one of his Molten Giants. He might play Jaraxxus though soon. He might even play now. I mean, he's running out of giants, so he's gonna want those six sixes. So many possibilities. Hmm. Okay. What else? My eyes are open. Still no executes. Maybe just Lofeb and Children Yeti here. Ah, it's kind of like I can't really. Or Sylvanas. Sylvanas doesn't really. But Mani Sylvanas, that's not very good. Could play Sludge Belcher Yeti. But I'm thinking, like, where is that Shadow Flame? Even if I play Lofeb, he can still Shadow Flame. But that would be pretty much all he could do, and it would only be free damage, so it wouldn't kill everything. Hmm. Let's play Lofeb. That killed the first version of this taunt. Slow on cards. Still looking for executes, as I keep saying, but. Uh, Maybe I'll finally get them sometime. I wouldn't mind a Death Spite either. Or Gromash. Or both. Getting a bit low on life too. Like some Handlocks run there. Double power overwhelming. So I gotta be careful with my health. Uh, let's see. Sludge Belcher. Maybe just... Double slot spell team. So do, do I attack that? Or do I go for the face? I don't really have any Okay, let's attack that. The thing is, he might use Shadow Flame on his Molten Giant, but that would be his last Giant. Hmm. But if I attack Face, that would actually have been even worse with the Shadow Flame. Uh oh, okay. Makes sense. Does he have another Taunt Giver? Oh, that's the Shadow Flame. Okay, but now he only has two cards left. 
I'll play Sylvanas here, I think. I have no time for games. Okay. Let's try and kind of go for the throat here. What a close game. I do not feel confident here. I guess it's like I'm just thinking soul fire double power overwhelming. I guess it's not that likely. I should not die this turn. Oh another taunt. That's totally not what I wanted to see. Oh wow, that's like so inconvenient. Execute, that is super convenient. So we do that. Finally, one might say. And then do that. I think I can attack the face. And I'm up. In case I get like death spite or something. I might need it for lethal. I think I have two death spites left, right? So that's actually a pretty high chance of drawing exactly that card. I also have Gromas left. Blood Hoof. I also have him left. Lots of good cards left, actually. Another execute. Well, those are 5 of the 10. Okay. No fan. And taunt. Okay, makes sense. Death Spite. Hmm. Well, this is weird. Like, it really depends on like what I steal. I really want to steal that. Um. Okay, come on. No. No, that's not what I wanted at all. Well, that's 50 50. Hmm. Two cards. Could your axis come now? I don't hope so. But it's actually kind of likely. Let's see if he does your access, he can kill that, kill that with the weapon, still have any one life. But it's taunt. That's what's so annoying about it. Hmm. Okay, no your access. Good. Oh no, lethal? Oh no, don't do, don't be lethal. Oh, another Shadow Flame. Wow. Battle Rage. Okay. <laughs> another Death Spite. Oh boy. I was thinking if I should equip it, but I, I'm just gonna keep it so he doesn't know I have it. But I'm, I don't know, maybe I should have equipped it in case I lot draw like Gromash or something. I wonder. Okay. <laughs> well, what, what is it gonna be? Your access? Do you have something else? Maligus. Okay. See, that's why I equip. Oh wow. Okay. Because then he he might have had something else that could have saved him. But wow, what a game! What a game! And a really long one to boot. Hey, okay. I'll take it. 
Well, let's see what we get next. <laughs> that was a fun game. Especially because uh, of the victory at the end. That always helps. Let's see what we get next. Alright. Druid. Not a top thousand. Top thousand is actually decent now. Uh, because I, there are like almost 4,000 people at that end now. Uh, let's see. I don't think Cruel Taskmaster is that good against Druid. Shade, though. Uh, it's nice to have a free drop around. And I, but I really want another two drop on Axe here. Yeah. That's. No. That's not what I wanted at all. That is what I wanted. Good. Good, good. Just hope he doesn't double innovate or something. Okay. <laughs> I can appreciate that he did not do that. Okay, what well, growth? So we have a ramp druid. I played a little bit of ramp druid myself yesterday. I did not do very well with it, unfortunately. So. And that's actually why I went back to the warrior. Like, I was kind of struggling a bit with the uh, hunter against priests and and uh, control warriors. So that's why I tried like ramp druid, but that didn't really work. And I went to the warrior, and it has been going a lot better. Hmm, I wish you played something for my axe to hit. Oh well. That's one raft gone. Does that mean he doesn't have a second raft? Probably should, like, kinda uh, keep the pressure going here. Because I prefer to win this one early. I think it's gonna be tough if it goes late. I would love for him to play, like, uh, Innovate, Ancient of War here, but unfortunately no such luck. Huh. That's interesting. I think I might just Battle Rage here. Because I don't really have anything to play. Okay, Acolyte. I'm afraid of an... Does he have another swipe? I don't think so. But even if it does, it's not the end. Let's do this. Kill that. Do 5 damage. Cool. Oh, now I hope I get Gromash. Because you're getting him pretty low here. So does he have a second swipe? That's the question. Oh, he does! Well, at least now I don't have to be afraid of swipe anymore. Low fev. Okay, that's pretty good. Like, that's very, very nice. Uh, if, I think only thing really a lot better would have been uh, Blood Hoof. Okay, let's play Low fev. When he plays a big taunt, I have the slam execute combo. Well, there we go. So let's do just that. Slam. Oh, Black Knight, if he plays a second one. Oh, that's great. Uh, let's play the Yeti here. Play a second Ancient of War, why don't you? Mmm. Mmm, okay. That's cool. <laughs> Not bad. <laughs> <laughs> that was pretty amazing. Okay. That was a, like, first game was super long, second game was super short. So overall that means that we do have time for a third game. Let's see what we get. I'm gonna try and keep climbing today to see if I can uh, get back up to that uh, top 100 spot. I, I think this deck could do it. I'm feeling pretty good about it. Can't say that these two games have hurt my opinion of the deck, but it went pretty well last night too when I played it. Uh, let's see here. Hmm, do I keep these two? 
I like the weapon. Hmm. It's not that good against water elemental though. Which I'm seeing a lot of kind of like mid rangey mages at the moment. I keep this. I'm good at killing loot hoarders. Ah, let's see if I can find a free drop actually. Or maybe an Amani. Okay, Amani. I would rather coin out with an Amani than a blood sale. Hmm. Well, wish I had the axe. Wish I had the axe. But let's do this. And if he buffs it up uh, with a death rattle, I can attack it and finish it off with Cruel Taskmaster. Mind if I roll need? Hmm. Was there another option? I mean, I could just full Taskmaster on that. But I don't have any way of killing that in the future. I should probably get rid of it. Yeah, it's too dangerous. Okay, let's do it. Wish I had the axe though. At least I have a good free drop. Right. Hmm, but he had a pretty good play here also. Mana Worm plus Fire Blast. That's pretty perfect for him. Ah, this is not great. Like, this is an Acro Mage, and it's an Acro Mage with a good start. I haven't had a bad start, but. This. I think I need to try and get board control. Do I do this? Like, I, I just I don't want to take any more damage. Kill that, that next turn. Attack there. I don't have any whirlwinds in hand. Okay, you know what? Let's just kill it. Like, I think I can win the long game against an Acro Mage, but I just I need to not take too much damage here. Water Elemental. Oh, that's gonna be rough. It's gonna be really rough. Sludge Belgia, that's good, but... Oh, well, I guess we'll Battle Rage here. Let's see what we draw. Hmm, could have used you earlier. Axe. So... Well... Hmm. It's like, I could play that so I could get that buff, but I'm not gonna play this one next turn anyway, because I'm gonna play a Sludge Belcher, I think. So let's just play this, because I, I'm not hitting the Water Elemental with the Axe. No, that doesn't make any sense. Okay, at least he slows down a little bit. Well, now I might actually play the axe, now that I think about it, because then I can get rid of that. And I can also play a shade. Or I can just play this one. I just kinda, I wanna get rid of that water elemental. Don't like them. So that, I know I can't attack with the axe next turn. But hopefully that'll be fine. At least I cleared the board. Okay, secret. That's not good because oh, it could be a mirror entity. In fact, it's quite likely to be mirror entity. That's that's not good at all. Hmm. Okay, so I guess if I play the Sludge Belcher, I can uh, Black Knight it next turn if it's a mirror entity. Uh, what am I 
I'm doing? I should have attacked with this one first. Ah, oh, that was a mistake. Yeah, that was not very good. Hmm. Ah, secrets. Now I wish I was playing the hunter. Fireball, jeez! Wow! And a fast bolt. And an ice lance! <laughs> oh my god! Now I know how that druid felt last game. Um. Um. Yeah. That's not good. Uh, do that. Right, right. I think... No, I still have a taunt up, I guess. So I'm not... Completely dead. Without him throwing a card. To get... Oh, yeah. You know what I mean. But this is looking pretty bad. At least it makes me feel a little better that it doesn't seem like it would have made much difference if I had attacked with that blood cell raider or not. Because I have a feeling that I'm dead here. Okay. Acromage. Viable. But so is the mid-range warrior. Thanks for watching everyone. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.